All right, what's going on YouTube and other people, whoever is watching this? Uh, be doing like an advanced setup for Soul Slayer. Um, this is not like a basic general tutorial for Soul Slayer. I'm pretty sure you can find one of those on their website or somewhere else on YouTube. This is going to be a video on how to cop and bulk like multiple pairs, five plus at least. Um, running one Soul Slayer and also, also multiple copies. Um, but if you guys don't know what Soul Slayer is, it's the best foot sight bot out there, hands down. So if you guys do not own it, I do recommend you go pick up a copy. Um, you go pick up uh, Soul Slayer Ultimate is the only version that I recommend you can pick it up from their website right now, as their group buys are closed. The only way that you can get a copy is from Soul Slayer themselves or from resale. So definitely recommend you guys go pick up a copy. But um. If my Discord could shut up, I could get this video on the way. So um, right now, I'm just gonna open Soul Slayer and show you guys how to set up properly for like a big release. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and delete these. This was uh, I had just pre-recorded this video and OBS crashed halfway through, so I'm just gonna have to redo it. But that's all right. So starting off, um, Soul Slayer is. Again, can, it's one of the best bots. It can handle so many tasks that you run on it, as long as you run it on a really good server. Um, don't recommend running higher than 500 tasks without a server, um, but on a really fast server with high CPU, you can run in between 1,000 to 1,500. And I think the developers told me that it caps out at 2,000, but they said they recommend in between 1,000 to 1,500. So getting straight into this video, um, just having Foot Locker as the test, uh, the test release, um, you're gonna want to go into the edit release when you're setting up obviously and you're gonna want to have your product link here obviously and Store just now is for locker. We're gonna get to the other stores in a second And you're gonna want to have imported your proxies here on this tab I'm not gonna click on this because then you guys are gonna see my proxies but um, after you import your proxies, you're gonna want to click randomize, and then uh, random proxy will come up here. Um, I'm not entirely sure what this does, but it's pretty important, I think. So just make sure you do it. Um, okay, so here are the checkout profiles. This is also extremely important. And here's another tip for Soul Slayer that a lot of people don't really know that um, a friend of mine told me: you can run the same checkout profile as many times as you want on a foot site. Um, I'm not I don't really think Footsite cancels the same payment options or they haven't canceled me um, And the reason why I say that you should run more than one checkout profile is because the way Soul Slayer is set up once one checkout profile So let's say this profile right here finishes checking out This one right here checks out a size 10 then the rest of uh, This profile will be done it'll the 25 tasks that are running for this profile will stop yeah, I've checked out, completed, finished, and it'll be done. So only the rest of these will be running. This one will be done. So that's why I run more than one um, checkout profile with the same card because um, if one of them checks out and you're only using one profile for this one card, then this one will just be completely done. So if you run 10 profiles on the same card, you can check out 10 pairs with the same card. Theoretically, it might not happen, but that's just the way I put it. So. Um, just me personally, I run a shit ton of cards. I run about 50, 10 of my own personal, uh, 10 of my own like credit card, and then like 30 to 50 pairs of privacy cards. Um, and then uh, what I do now is the most important part is how I replicate all of my tasks per profile or per uh, website I mean. So here you're running a one to one task ratio, right? So you can have each uh, you have 275 proxies and 275 tasks for Foot Locker. So what you can do is you can copy this again, copy it one more time, and then copy it a fourth time. And you're going to want to test video two, change this to champs, randomize your proxies. Same thing on the checkout profile, it's the exact same because it's a different site. You can run the same checkout profiles on a different site multiple times. So you're gonna have the same checkout profiles for each different site. It'll work perfectly fine. Test video three, click randomize on your proxies. Edit again. I think the last one is foot action. Randomize again, same checkout profiles. Boom, so now you have you have 275 proxies spread across four different sites. 
Um, the way I look at it is each 100 tasks for Soul Slayer will give you one shoe. So what I usually like to do is I will buy a thousand monthly proxies and run a thousand proxies through Soul Slayer. So what I would do is use about 500 proxies on one instance of Soul Slayer. This is what I was talking about earlier. You can run two copies, but you will need to have purchased two copies because you can't run another instance off just one copy. So I, if you really are like a try hard in the sneaker game or you're really into copy shoes in bulk, you definitely should pick up another copy. So what I do, I use one copy for personals and then I use another copy to um, run my slots that I'm trying to hit for people on. So you can duplicate this. So what I do, I'll split my proxies in half. So say I have uh, 600 proxies, I'll run 300 here just like this. And then on another instance of Soul Slayer, I'll run 300 the same way with just different checkout profiles. So I know this sounds like a lot, but it's really not so difficult if you um, already have your checkout profile saved. Um, but if you're setting it up for the first time, it's definitely going to take you some time to set it up. At least a few hours it takes me my first time. But now it only takes me about 30 minutes to an hour. But um, yeah, this is pretty much how you can cop like like heavily in bulk with social layer. It's definitely the best bot for foot sites. It never lets me down. I've always copped at least like a couple of shoes with social layer, no matter how hype the release is. As long as you set it up correctly, it should be straight. But like... Um, like I was saying is if you really 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 am, am trying to cop in bulk You really need to go pick up two copies multiple copies or try to just rent a copy because like One copy can only run max 2,000 Tasks, but they recommend a uh, thousand to fifteen hundred So if you're running a thousand tasks or twelve hundred tasks on each copy of Soul Slayer on two different servers You're gonna cop 20 to 30 10 15 pairs of the shoes you're gonna cop a lot of shoes so this is how i set up you know i spread my proxies across each release i usually dial it down to 100 tasks or less on foot action just because i don't really hit that much on foot action but um yeah this is pretty much how i set up hope you guys enjoyed this video uh pretty advanced so i hope you guys could stay with it but um again hope you guys enjoyed it if you did enjoy it give me a like maybe even hit the sub button i post a lot of content like this so if you guys did enjoy it uh, I should definitely click the notifications bell as I, I'm going to be posting pretty frequently now. But um, yeah, see you guys in the next video. We out. Peace.